It is the vision of the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Abdullah, to transform the economic face of the kingdom with the construction of the new financial district that bears his name in Riyadh. This landmark project is of supreme national and international importance and will both accommodate the kingdom's and the world's financial giants, placing Saudi Arabia in the front rank of the world's financial markets. Among the many contracts in this project that the Saudi Bin Laden Group is privileged to work on, this presentation shows the PPA 30 contract. For such a huge undertaking to be successful, it is imperative that a golden triangle rule of communication between client, engineer and contractor, along with the seamless interaction between time, cost and quality is established early in the project and assiduously maintained. It is the engineer who has the duty to ensure the approval and change mechanisms between the client and contractor work smoothly. During the design stage, multiple reviews, three times the number agreed in the contract and slow approval retarded the construction process enormously. Delays caused by slow approval mounted. One, for example, extended to 160 days and a second to 299 days. Contrary to contractual agreement, the client imposed restrictions on the countries of origin that plant and materials could be sourced from. Following the client's insistence, SBG purchased materials, particularly for the façade, from Western Europe. This caused procurement difficulties and delay. And in the case of the façade, 405 days and increased expense by approximately 1 billion Saudi rials. The revised designs increased the complexity of the buildings. Architecturally complicated shapes required new structures and presented considerable civil engineering challenges. SPG met them, but once again it took time, caused delay and raised costs. The iconic but challenging faceted façade required extensive structural reworking and upgrades in materials. The upgraded glazing specification alone added 300 million Saudi rials to the cost. The client instruction to change the building heights from varied to maximum needed extensive internal alterations to the structures. The window cleaning equipment was re-specified by the client to be building maintenance units with glass replacement capability. The all-important finishing materials were subject to a client-led alteration in specification. One example, after re-specification was that the three contractual stone types finally reached 250. The MEP specifications were also modified by the client to a great extent. Control systems, CCTV, access control and BMS were upgraded to the nominated supplier Johnson Controls specifications with the additional requirement for all buildings to be integrated with a central command station. PPA 30 contract, whose original completion date was 27th November 2012, with a budget of approximately 14 billion Saudi rials. However, enhancements and upgrades desired by the client on the PPA 30 resulted in delays and increased costs. Design changes resulted in an additional delay of 331 days. Country of origin issues incurred an additional almost 1 billion Saudi rials over 405 days. Additional works caused delays of up to 565 days with costs of approximately 800 million Saudi rials. Upgrades to buildings saw an increase of over 1.3 billion Saudi rials over an additional 567 days. Other unaccounted for delays ran on for 614 days, exceeding 42 million Saudi rials. And financial issues and overheads caused an additional cost of 1 billion rials.
The revised completion date for contract PPA 30 is now the 30th of June 2014. To successfully complete the contracts to the new specifications on the high standard both SBG and the client would wish, the following requirements are essential. The completion time for the contract PPA 30 to be extended to June 2014. The completion time for contract PPA 10 to be extended to April 2013. That the client writes to the aforementioned banks confirming the completion date changes. RIC to pay SBG 50% of the total submitted claims to date, which is 2,750 million Saudi Rials, taking into consideration that SBG is currently preparing additional remaining claims to be submitted in due course. In addition, and absolutely central to the amicable achievement of our mutually desired targets, that a third party is appointed to activate the committee formed by His Excellency the Governor of Public Pension Agency to resolve outstanding and future issues between SBG and RIC. That the appointee review and approve the submitted claims within one month and review and approve future claims from SBG, now in preparation, within one month of submission. That the appointee take decisions in a timely manner with regard to any issues that could affect the progress of the project or any claims that arise in the future. Until now, the Saudi Bin Laden Group has carried the financial burden entirely on its own for the execution of the requested additional works. The result is that SBG has incurred major obligations toward the banks financing the project and towards SBG's suppliers and manufacturers. The changes and upgrades in design and build of mega projects are always to be expected, with changes to the original contract requirements for enhancement of the final project. As a result, Adjustment to the contract price and time for completion is required.